The following contest is a triple threat extreme rules match. It is for the international welterweight and pre-championship. Introducing the challenger from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 260 pounds, the assassin, Alex King. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up. And a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. And introducing the challenger from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, weighing in at 201 pounds, Teddy Hart. This is a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael, and here tonight. Big matches are where this guy thrives, and competing for that title is about as big as it gets. One of the best superstars around. And introducing the champion from Tennessee, weighing in at 238 pounds, the international welterweight Grand Prix champion, Jeff Jarrett. Of course, the title is on the line in this one, guys. And don't be surprised if history is made here tonight. I know the champ has looked good as of late, but I'd say the opposition has looked just as good, if not better. As far as title defenses go, this is about as big as it gets. He needs to be on his game tonight. That championship right there is what it's all about, gentlemen. So here we go, extreme rules, basically anything goes. You can win by pinfall or submission. Every hold, every surface, every object in the arena is all fair game for these combatants. Setting him up for the flatliner. Oh, man, face first. There's a reason this is called a triple threat match. The threats are everywhere, Cole. Two opponents, zero rules. And on top of that, you don't have to be the one pinned to still lose the match. You have to be ready for anything. Oh, man. That'll... Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Denying a two count there. That's still a quick kick out at this point. He's heading back to the ring. Tearing down the leg now. There is some power behind that punch. Heads and of course, kendo sticks are always under the ring in the event of any rogue ninja attacks. Kendo stick impact. Staved off that attack. Every successive move is putting their opponent in a dicey situation. Suplex. 
This isn't the smartest thing to do. Antagonizing your opponent instead of attacking him. Ooh, targeting the leg there. Knee finds the abdomen. Oh my God, a moonsault. Going up top. From the top. 450 elbow. Here's the pin title on the line. Just beats the three count. Wow. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Yeah, that was a nasty Samoan driver. Oh, well placed knee right to the midsection. He takes control. And this one might be headed ringside. And now with the kendo stick in hand, he's ready to do some real damage. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Belly to belly. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Oh! He saw that one coming. Look at this, going counter for counter. Legs caught. Right back in the ring now. From behind. Back suplex. Re-entering the ring now. He'll head to the ring. Yeah. Ripcord. Lariat. Headlock applied and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. He gets set down to the floor. Pick the leg. Oh, man. That'll tear your hamstring. He is having his way in this one now. Yeah, it's one attack after the other with him. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Oh, oh. driver. Spiked him. It's just right forearm. Being carried around with ease. Oh, right across the throat. Good golly, Miss Molly. Uh-oh, watch out! Double rusted leg sweep! Cover for the championship! The pin's broken up. This can't bode well. Suplex! The title might change hands! Cover! Two! And we have a new champion! Unbelievable! Here is your winner! And new international welterweight Grand Prix champion, the Assassin.